everybody welcome to this episode of zebra to zebra and since everybody went to the conference and has such amazing wonderful stories to tell you um, they are going to be doing lots of videos on all sorts of topics and anything that they learned from the conference unfortunately I was not there so I don't have anything for you from the conference and nobody's left me any questions the last week so I'm gonna just do a video from something that I've been working on on my blog I just did a post on drinks that are great for POTS, postural tachycardia syndrome. And today I'm just going to show you how to whip up one of those drinks really quickly and tell you why it's so good for you. So um, in the bottom of my container, um, my blender container, I have squeezed the juice of one lime. I already did that and I did it off camera so I apologize for not having that in front of me. So anyway, we're going to add to that about a cup of ice. one cup of watermelon so I have a little tiny personal size watermelon I'm just gonna scoop out one cup's worth and that's gonna pretty much be most of this half of watermelon looks like the dogs are lining up because they want their share as well And lastly, the key ingredient to the drink that we're making is smoked sea salt. So this is a smoky watermelon slush. And in order to get the smokiness, you need smoked sea salt. Um, this is Alderwood smoked sea salt. It is amazing. I got it at Whole Foods. It smells like a campfire the moment that I took that off. Mm, I'm just campfire, campfire, campfire. So good, so, so yummy, such a key ingredient. So I'm just going to put in a teaspoon of that to give it a nice, smoky, salty flavor. Um, so one teaspoon of that. And that's it gonna pop it on the blender blend it till it's nice and slushy and then we will be ready to drink because you don't want it to melt it completely. You want it nice and slushy, good for the hot summer days. So. We'll just pour that into our glass. in a big straw mmm so yummy so salty 
so smoky. So why is this a good drink for pots? Well, to start out, it's a good drink for anybody that has any toxins in their body because watermelon is detoxifying. You're gonna get the water from the watermelon and from the ice, which is hydrating, which is really important in these hot summer days. You've got the salt, which is essential for POTS people. And you've got lime juice, which has vitamin C in it. And sometimes I'll even throw a little bit of the zest in there. Um, and vitamin C is great for those with EDS. So this is just an all around good drink to keep you hydrated. I have a lot of other recipes on the blog as well. So I will put the link below and you can go visit and check out the fun summertime recipes for pots and EDS and I welcome any questions that you have for me about anything EDS or POTS related or mental health related. Just leave them below this post and I will see you guys next week for the next episode of Zebra to Zebra. Have a great day and don't forget, visit the blog, lifewitheds.com. Bye!